ngana anaenda ana, ana mwanzo wa babangu aliuza ngombe ngombe karibu tatu ndo nipelekwe shule ndo nipelekwe nifanye hiyo caregiving in UK so tukakuwa tunaitishwa pesa alafu process tukiuliza wanatuambia tu wana tu wana postpone tu wana postpone tukiuliza the first lot because i was among the fourth lot we were around five lots but i was in the fourth lot na we gave out 240000 in cash na kumbuka hiyo siku hata babangu vile tuli struggle na yeye nikimpaka nilikuwa nampostia online nampostia online ndo tupate mtu mwenye anaweza nunua so na tukapeleka cash na tukaandikiwa receipt i have the receipts ya hooking ni kangangana nikajinyima nikaenda nikachukua loan 400 1000 nikapea kijana mwenye alikuwa ametoka Kisi University Lawrence Nzuki na yeye naye mwenyewe akangangana kwa mutumba akaongeza sama amount tukalipa kwa Judith chepchirichiri it is now two years since nimelipa hii pesa kweli kama mama nimeumia kulipa hii pesa hooking Sambudi mwenye anajua life ya hoka it is so painful mvua inakunyeshea jua inakupiga yote unangangana this alone that i took from family bank nikalipa judith chepchirichiri na nimejaribu kumufikia lakini ni shida um, kwetu tuko watu waine mimi ndio first born na uta single baron mimi nikaa baba ya watoto wengine ama ndugu zangu ni wale walikutana wote kwa darasa moja last year walikuwa wanafanya form for wote walikuwa wameshikana wote like sasa mimi nilikuwa kama msaze mimi nikaa kila kitu kwao walikuwa wanamtakia masuri nitoke at least nikilia school fees nifanye anything nyumbani kurudi nyumbani nimekaa nao nikaambiwa kuna kasi imetokea ya security imekataa kuja fanya kashia sababu ya kashia ndo wanaenda trip ya kwanza nikakuja tena kukuja ni pesa kuandika cv ni pesa hao ndo wanakuandikia cv cv nilikuwa naandikwa na elfu moja na huyo mama ukimwambia kuambia that's not my problem na tulileta pesa zetu ikiwa cash saya i was planning nilikuwa na jaribu ya nilikuwa nataka ni jaribu ya Canada kufika huko kuambiana mamangu ni strict yeye anajua senator anajua ngamba na kuambia oh nataka kurudia pesa town na nilikuwa nimepata opportunity niende sa niko stranded sai Sign me up at town what do I want to take a bunny I have three children look on the gun and you should click and you apart some so much my what so in game now in mama kweli ana chukua beza sango I remember the time our president wakati alikuwa anasema ni kieka chini tu will deal with that tell na hapa Eldoret it was a mob champion but now imebadilika imekuwa omo cartels imekuwa homo cartels asandeni sana senators kwa kujaba kutusaidia please tutawashika nguo mpaka mtatusaidia asante asante the last two asante mr chairman kwa majina ni elias kipto ningependa tu ni wasalamu nyinyi Niwasalamia nyinyi wote katika jina la Yesu. Mimi naitwa Chris Corel. Nililipia mtoto akisema anaenda UK. Mara wanamuita aende Nairobi, atimitiane. Mimi sina mse. Aliaka. Ninangangana, ninamlipia, nililipa tu 250. Lakini hakuna siku mtoto ameenda. Hiyo ndio nasikia uchungu sana. Maybe chair. Of my grandson, a son for my daughter, my firstborn. Alilipa 115,000. Niliambia wausa hapa neka ili mtoto huyo aweze kwenda asaidie wengine. Up to today ajaenda mahali popote na wajarudishiwa pesa. Ninaomba kamati hii kwa ajili ya Mheshimiwa Cherargei Senator Wanandi afanye kuwa hata acting senator wa hapa ili atuweze kutusaidia mambo hii ambayo imekuwa magumu. Kwa sababu 
unaomba kwa sababu hii hado committee hapa wali declare eh, Judith kuwa eh, hostile na mimi naomba mu declare today kwa Judith ni hostile na ikifika jioni Subaru imepeleka inakuru <laughs> ili tupate justice ya kulipwa pesa chairman pesa alikataa ilipwe kwa bank ama kwa mpesa we as ncs i think even the petitioners will agree with us that we really took them to task the unfortunate thing that was there is that um judy was being protected by the lawyer zaidi ya 360 million and above na watoto waliotoka nchi hii ni chini ya watoto hamsini peke yake bwana mwenyekiti pesa hizi nyingi alizopokea aliweza kuwahonga maofisa wa polisi wa DCI na ndiposa umesikia walikuwa naenenda kupeleka kesi yao wanaambiwa fuata judi msikizane na wanapoenda kusikizana kuna pie katika ofisi ile ana mwili amebarikiwa na Mungu alikuwa akiwanyonga watoto wetu wengine wametolewa meno alafu unarejea katika county assembly la senator cheral gay na tunamheshimu sana amesema yeye ni karibu na ofisi ya rais kwa kupitia mwenyekiti rais aweze kujulishwa kwamba kuna mtu anaitwa judi na in fact hata wakati ambako walikuwa wanafanya launch ya digital platform yeye ndiye aliongea mbele ya rais kusema kwamba wameshikana na serikali kuwapeleka watoto wetu nje mlagai kamili I'm not aware of such <laughs> so oh, oh, what do you mean in fact i have I have shared with the president your concerns and the others that are under investigations and the president has confirmed for the benefit of all of us you saw him spoke in town and said even when he was addressing the evolution conference he said he, he, under his administration there will be no space for the corrupt so you can see there is goodwill from the president and the government so as the chair has advised let us pursue our justice for everybody for the refund of money and if anybody has violated the law let them fail full force of the law i think that would be uh, that would be in order uh we requested the executive to revoke her license her operating license because that one is within our domain and again honorable chair we requested the executive not to have this lady represent county government of Wasengishu in any way that was part of our recommendation and we were ashamed to see her representing the government of Kenya uh in 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 in, in when when launching that uh, digital platform umetuambia wale walishikwa na polisi kwa kuzingiziwa wale mapolisi walifanya kuzingiziwa kama pale ndugu yetu kushikwa tu makosa yake ni kuuliza haki yake ulikuwa umesema ama polisi watachukuliwa hatua through aipoa i think chair as we go back to nairobi the inspector general of police and the dcio mr amin and the minister of interior Professor Kindiki must appear before our committee to tell us the status of the investigation. Kama rais jana wale ambao walihusika na sakata ya Finland wameshikwa na kuwekwa ndani. Kwani huyu ni Mungu aweze shikwa? Hii serikali chairman utakubaliana na mimi. Tumezunguka tukisema tutasaidia hustlers. Tutasaidia wale wako chini wapande juu. Justice denied. Justice delayed is justice denied. Hawa watoto wameangaishwa vya kutosha. Tuandike report. Kulikuwa na report ya IG ambayo ilikuwa ije. There were criminal offenses apart from him ni ambayo zimeibiwa. Huyu mama hajashikwa, amejaribu kuuawa vijana. Na anatembea tu kwenye hii nchi na kama we living in a banana republic. Dogo. Lakini huyu? Ai. Huyu alitoka wapi? Hiyo si tabia yetu. So ndio nasema ya kwamba tuko pamoja na ninyi na mimi najua kwa yale yalitendeka jana chuma ya huyu ki wapi ki motoni she has some money 
We have another lady who was given 375, so some have been given, but the majority have not been given. The Poland, Poland part of UK, some left the country through other agencies. They gave up and proceeded. In the UK matter, there's also another case in court, pending before court, which is not subject to what we are having. We ever had a case in court, we didn't bring them on board. Though we know that case really died because uh, the file disappeared from the, from, the, from, the, from the registry. So we are really still following up on the matter. And uh, we, are, we are also following up on with LSK. Because the man behind this thing, actually the man misadvising Judith mostly, is Henry Kenney, who doubles up as LSK chair. We want to ask LSK, what is the opinion about these controls happening in Eldoret? And the person who is taking control, advising Judith to con people more, is one of their own. It's a shame to legal family. A total shame. Even when she was here, Keneo was almost being sworn in as a witness. We cannot, it's a very small line between Keneo and, uh, and Judith. So that's a different thing. So on Qatar, I think we are talking in terms of 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000 people. As we speak, today we got 200 new people on board. They're signing outside there. So that's why we are requesting this house to give us time to, to update this list by at least Tuesday next week will be, those who will not be part of it will be and locked maybe out. Maybe through you, Chair, I hope these new 200 